I always believe in one thing. And I believe that whatever little that you have, share with others. And I do a lot of projects with my own money. I don't look for funding from somewhere. Why? Because I believe that the little God has given me, even waking up every day, is a blessing. So whatever little money you have, don't just think about you. I'm going to buy a plot. I want to buy a car. So you are hustling, you are suffering, you are working hard. But the reality is the little you have always also make a difference. When you pray to God, pray to God to give you more. And why will you pray to God? You need to have a justification. Oh God, and this my prayer always, oh God, if you give me, I'm going to give to others. If you make a difference in my life, I'm going to make a difference in other people's lives. So when you get small money, when you get something little, don't just keep on to yourself. Most people keep a lot of money to themselves. All the blessings God has given you, you keep that to yourself. And sometimes God finds it difficult to bless you more because he's giving you more and you've held that back. Sometimes just look around. There may be somebody who is needy. You give the person. But you need to know people who are in need and people who just come and bring something up to take your money. So I do these projects because I believe that the little I have, I'm not that rich. But I believe that the little God has given me. I say thank you Allah. And I also go back to do, give back to society. If it is 100 cities, I make sure that 10 cities goes to someone's pocket too. If it is 1,000, say Alhamdulillah, and I'm going to do more. And once you are doing this, when you pray, you say, God, the little you gave me, I was able to touch someone's life. And if you give me more, I can make a difference. If you give me more, if you bless me more, I can make a difference in other people's lives because I'm going to feed people. I'm going to give people the opportunity to live their lives. I'm going to be there for others. And this is the only reason why God will give you. It's not your strength. It's not your talent. I've seen people who have been talented. They work hard. They work like donkeys. But yet they are not blessed. But you, you're blessed. So don't only keep up to yourself. Make sure you give back to society. It could be a project. It could just be sharing your knowledge with somebody. Sometimes we feel like it's only about money that you give to people. But the little you have, whatever you just give up to somebody. I do public speaking. I sell my books and online courses. And that's all I do. There's no other source of income from somewhere. I sold share butter, but it's not working like I expect. But then I just need to be there for others. Why am I saying that I need to be there for others? When I, I needed people to support me, a lot of them uh, didn't support me. Most people didn't support. I just had a few friends who were there for me and I'm loyal to them. So go out there and make a difference. It may be tough. I'm telling you, the little you have can make a difference in someone's life. It could be feeding someone a day, even in a year. Feed the person well and make sure that the person says, wow, may God bless you for feeding me. And that can make a difference in your life. So when you pray, you have a justification. When you ask from God, you have a justification. 